news that matters. Fox 40 News at 5 starts now. But first, protesters and drivers clash. Members of Black Lives Matter out again this afternoon, making their voices heard nearly two months after the death of Stephon Clark, this time at Sacramento's historic pot festival. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Joe Khalil. The Clark was shot and killed by officers on March 18th in his grandparents' backyard. And since then, demonstrators have been out every single week. And today, protesters blocked Exposition Boulevard, at one time blocking the entrance to Cal Expo, where the Cannabis Cup is being held. It's the first of its kind marijuana festival in the nation that's attracted thousands of visitors to Sacramento. And that is where we find Fox 40's Doug Johnson. Doug, I know there were a lot of people there today. Certainly a protest could disrupt things there. It certainly did, Joe. And as you take a look behind me, the main entrance here to Cal Expo is back open right now, as is Exposition Boulevard. But for about two hours, like you mentioned, this was all shut down. And as you take a look at some of the video we shot earlier today, you can see some of the drivers who got stuck in this uh, traffic jam were not happy with these protesters. Now, some were trying to go to the Cannabis Cup here at Cal Expo, while others were just trying to use this busy street. And one or two drivers actually told us they agree with the Justice for Stephon Clark movement, but they felt this accomplishes nothing. Now, Black Lives Matter protesters did gather for about two hours before the shutdown. Actually, many of them calling their friends, trying to get more people to come out. In the end, there was about 50 or so people. And take a listen to why Black Lives Matter Sacramento organizers decided to shut down the Cannabis Cup event today. Stephon Clark was murdered almost two months ago, and we need the, the people to know in this city that we're still fighting. Um, we're at a concert where there's a lot of artists that claim to be for this movement, um, but they're not talking about it. Um, and so we're out here today to make sure that Stefan's name is lifted. Yeah, and those artists that she was talking about include Lauren Hill, uh, Little Wayne, and Cypress Hill, all playing a concert tonight at the Cannabis Cup. And as far as we know, that event is going as scheduled, uh, going to be happening tonight. People still getting in now. And even when the roads were shut down, Joe, uh, folks were able to actually park their car across the street and were able to walk in or park in other parking lots around Cal Expo and still get inside of this event. But traffic certainly was backed up for a matter of hours. Reporting live in Arden tonight, Doug Johnson, Fox 40 News. All right, Doug, thank you. That's one we're going to keep our eyes on as well.